Hi, how's everybody doing today? This is Sean. I'm with Joshua. Hello. And uh, Joshua's got a new channel. What's your channel name? Uh, Cardmaster. Cardmaster. So if you guys want to go over there, he'll download some videos, make some videos for him. He's going to start his own channel. And uh, it's Cardmasters. So please like and subscribe. And uh, we got these two boxes over at, um, I don't know, I might even remember. And there's so many places they sell these things. But um, there's one in eight chance to get hit. So we're going to open these up. There are some vintage stuff in there. Box doesn't look like it's tampered. And let's go. Let's see if we can find a trout. Yeah. Last one I opened up, I got an autograph. Uh, the football one, I got Jamil, uh Sanders. What is it? Anyway, I think it was rookie I got autograph. It was a Sage card. Um, one of the Steelers running backs, I forget his name right now, but I can't believe I can forget his name, and I'm a Steelers fan, but it's, it is pretty cool. I'll show it to you guys. It's been a long day. Anyway, we got our pack is uh, Edition 1992 Reefs Baseball Edition Series 2. Not bad. Some good players in there. I think that we have uh, in that series, we'll be looking for um, Mike Piazza. So that's that would be the guy we'll be looking for. I usually don't open those packs. It was just like until I get ready to send them out to get graded because there's stuff in there. Sometimes it's, it's gradable. So our first card is Dan Pantry. He's a pretty good pitcher. He played for uh, Red. I uh, also played for, De I was going to say Chicago, but he played for Detroit and he played for the Angels. And this is a 1990. So that common right there. Yeah, the Ken, I, did, I'm, I suck at reading, so okay. I can can a Manny. Yeah. He's good. He passed away. He's a really good player. He was one of the best players. Unfortunately, they were saying that steroids might have been an issue, but I don't believe it. It's just people's heart go. Go ahead, buddy. Yeah, Mike Marshall. Mike Marshall's a good player. They're all Leafs. 1990. So this Cam Eddie, I would put that aside. He's a good player. And then go through it like that. We got uh, Edwin Winston. Same thing. I put Pacey on that one. Lonnie Smith, he's a good player. Everybody knows Lonnie. I put him on the side. Rick uh, Baker, uh, rookie guard. Gold. Holy smokes, we got a no. Oh, we don't. Never mind. Go ahead. I was looking. I thought they were numbered. It's the way they're stamped. It's pretty cool. I'll show you this series real quick. These are all the same series. And this series is from the, it's got, this is a rookie, Anthony Manhattan, ultra rookie. So it has a little bend in the card. You see the bend in it? The crease right down the middle of it. Pretty badass rookie card. I think it. this is a Don Ross, it's 2015. And is it an auto? No. Brian Howard, great first Brian baseman. Howard. It's nice, 15. Don and Ross. Then we got Don Van Tap, uh, uh, Todd Van Pella. This dude threw like a ball, like over a hundred miles an hour. He's a beast. I do like the way they did the ultra flare ones. They're like yeah, Gary pretty badass. Gatey, pretty sure that's how you pronounce his name. Okay, yeah. flip it over. Uh, Gary Gatey. Gary Getty. Getty, yeah. He's good too. We got two of them. One right there. Or all three, all three of those together. Yeah, Brian Harper, same series. Not a rookie, but it's pretty cool. We are going to sleep these cards up, like I said. I'm just putting them Another aside. one of the Gary. Oh, my God. Eddie Murray. Nice, nice, nice. nice. At the end of his career, we'll put a sleeve on that one. We got a Joe Hall. Joe Hall's good. Looks like that's a rookie card, too. Yeah. So you want to play that. So we got the same series. And then I got Chipper Jones out of that series, too. Uh, UD. This is UD... Uh, 99 or 2000 i'm sorry pretty cool end of his career it's hard to pronounce i can't see the name but yeah that. let's see we got refractors oh this is varaz this is uh this is varaz he played second base for the uh for, uh, the atlanta brace for a while his name was uh culvillo Covillo Varez, Covillo Varez, something like that. It's a typical name to mention, but there's a t he's a he's definitely a, a, a fan favorite. And then uh, we got Todd Bringers. We got um, 
Elias Burks, gold. So I'll look at this one. Two years. This is a big card right here. This is Russell Teese. He was considered to be a really good pitcher back in the day. Uh, the, uh, this is a second year. It's like a second year card. He only played 22 games in the major, so a pretty cool card. I'm put that over Got there a nice Henry. refractor here. I don't know his name, but a nice refractor. Do you know his name? Oh, that's David Cohn. That's a beautiful card. That's a flare. Yeah. I put a paint sleeve on that right away. Immediately, yeah. that is an expensive series, that right there. Very expensive series. Serious talk. Um, yeah, those are expensive. Fla Any flare all, uh, cards that you find, I don't care if they're common players, if you collect, uh, you put them in paint sleeves and keep them aside because it's a great set. Oh, there's uh, modern stuff here. This is uh, from, uh, let's see. This is 2020-20, so we got some modern stuff, and I'll sort through it later. And then we got no oh my goodness, I got a great rookie. This dude's an awesome player. Noose, that's good, good, good. I'll put a paint sleeve on that. Got Chapman. Go through this a little quicker. Oh man, look at this Bowman Chrome, and this is from 2000 when 2020-20. Kirk Scribble, Bowman Chrome, beautiful. This is why I'm wearing gloves, unfortunately, right there. See there? See, there's a mark in the middle of it. Son of a bitch. It's top 100. That's not bad, though. It'd probably be an 8. That sucks that's there on that. There's a nice rookie, too. Terrell Williams. These are throwbacks. From 2020. These are nice. These are like a... His name, they're signing a name on them. Sometimes they have the real autographs. You have to look on them. 20 right here. It's Kevin Biggio's Bowman. Oh, nice. Okay. That's Biggio. Oh, Biggio. Yeah, that's Craig Biggio's son. It's a good card. It's a second year card. And uh, don't be, you know, those names are kind of difficult to pronounce. So. This is Francisco Mara. He's a good catcher. I always like the Bowman anyway. This is a good picture too, second year. I'm just kind of going through some of these. Yeah. Oh, Garrett Cole, man. Nice. League leader. They're saying uh, he cheats and stuff, but I don't know how, how you could do it. Jeremy Dye. He's also a fan favorite. Jeremy Dye. This is from the 2000s. 2001 tops. Or Bowman Chrome. It's like Bowman Gold. It's pretty badass. And uh, sometimes the real autographs are on them. You have to look on the back. It says physical show, signature shown as appears as on original rookie tops. Uh, so this is a remake of his uh, rookie card. Pretty cool. It's a special insert. Put that there. It's another Lonnie Smith. That Don Paul. Kevin Kurtz. Oh, she's in this. Don Franco. And Don Franco. Nice. He's a Hall of Famer. And then this is another one. Fiscal signature. And this is Gil. This is Gil McGee. Jeff uh, McGee. Robinson. Gil McGee. I don't know if he ever made it. I remember seeing him play a little bit. Let's still put him over here with this fella. Kent uh, Bontfield. Kent Bontfield. Kent got a feed. 1993. Denard Cruz. Paul Gibson, a Flare 91. Nice, that's a good one. Here's another good one. This is uh, Willie Ru Rudolph at the end of his career, but he's a good player. Gary Wor Ward. Oh, uh, not the end of his career. Yeah. He, he played for the Yankees. He was in the 70s. This guy got his rookie card, actually. It's a nice card. I like that one. Jack Homel, Flair. Yeah, nice. Is that Sandy Almar? No, Terry McGriffin. Terry McGriff. It's a catcher. Got two cards there, buddy. Yeah. Jerry Wither. Andy Ashby. He was supposed to be really good. He was sort of good, up and down player. Mike Boddicker, Flair, 92. Mm -mm -mm. Got a nice Dave Justice here. This collector's choice. 
Still, Joe Carter. Joe Carter's Hall of Famer. We'll put him aside. Dan Ward. Dan Ward. Yep. Looks like the 90s. 90s baseball. It is 1990. You got Willie McGee. Pat Listich. We got Don Slott. He's a Hall of Famer. Dave Fleming, Hall of Famer. Got this cool card. That is a cool card. That's a very cool card. Who is that? Wait a minute. That, you know who that is? That's Bo Jackson, I think. Flip it over. Wait a minute. It's kind of hard to tell. What does it say on there? Didn't say really anything. Oh, it tells you how to get to the World Series. Hmm. Oh, this Hugan. is um, the art. This is a good card, man. It's a nice card. It tells you you can actually um, order the sketch. They'll send it to you. We got Charles Hayes, great player for the Yankees all time. And I also got one of them ones here. And this one is nice, and man. Jeff Juden. It's really cool. Nice, nice, nice. So we got a little collection. And for the price, they're five bucks. So if you were going to put these sets together, you definitely will get cards. And you're going to get Hall of Famers. There's some, like, maybe a corner issue here or whatever, but... All in all, and they're all you got to go through these cards because they're this also in this print. Cool. It's 1992. Oh man, nice. Gary Sanchfield. Ch Gary Sheffield, that's his rookie yeah. card. And then Edger. Edgar. Yeah, Edgar. Mar. Martinez. Two Hall mm -hmm. of Famers. You got a good card. Put paint sleeve on that. That's an awesome card. Good job, buddy. Man, that's a good. Gary Sheffield's an underrated player. That dude used to come, He's a big player. Here's Tim Raines, Hall of Famer. I always take the Hall of Famers and put them aside. And the reason why I wear a Carlson Fisk. Got his rookie card. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, he came out in the 70s. And uh, Tim, Juan Samuel. He's a good player. A lot of people like Juan Samuel. Samuel. Samuel, sorry. Uh, Dodgers. Played for a long time. He was a fan favorite. I think he's from Puerto Rico. Um... Antonio Fescusca, he's a hell of a pitcher back in the day. He's a beast. Big man. Doug Jones. Ozzie Gillen, another good one. Dick Scoff, he was alright. Not a big fan of his pitching. He's another good player. This Paul Maroba. Oh, nice. That's a stamp card. Gold stamp. Who's that? Um... Riley Monton. Nice. We got a nice Cleveland Indians of my man Sandy Alomar. Yes, yes, yes. That's going to get pain sleeve for sure. Sandy Alomar is one of my favorite. Oh, man. Felix o Jose, too. He's badass. I like him, too. That's one of my favorite pitchers. I grew up in the era when baseball was fun to watch. A lot of people walked away from it's, baseball during the 1993 strike. Oh, 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 see, it isn't so... See, it isn't so. Who's the white trout? No, 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 not yet. I'm going to get the trout. But, Don Mattingly, the franchise, 1991 score. Of course, the corners aren't that good. And I should be putting this in a place, too. This is from this year. Damn, it's a shame that has a thing on it. If this was, if that didn't have that thing on and it, it would one? be like a nine. Nice. Rafael Paramara would be in a Hall of Fame, but he was considered one of the people that used steroids. Hell of a player, though. Todd Bendinger, he's a good player. Top 40. It's a good set to put together. These are kind of cool, too. Hey, babe. Jacob War Warlick. Oh, I'm sorry. Jason Veritek. This is a hell of a card right here. This is 13th year card, but Christian. it's upper deck, and he was a hell of a player. Dave Valley, another good player. Bob Boone. Bob Boone's awesome, dude. There you go. All-star card. Good hit. He coached and his sons played in the baseball league. There's Mike lots of Smith. people. Yeah, Mike Smith is a beast, dude. Chase Utley. That's what year is this? No, this is fourth year card. Chase Utley, fan favorite. This looks like a big one. Eric Stone. 
Aaron Riley Flair, wait, Flair 90. And we, we have, have top 40 record breaker. No Ryan. Is that Nolan Ryan? Yeah, yeah, man. Put that in pace. That's Nolan Ryan, buddy. Good hit. <clears throat> this guy used to hit a ton. I mean, he hit the ball so hard. Doug, Doug, Doug Mantecovici. Kovatsky or something like that. I can't say his name correctly. But Manahukowitzki. Mike Manahukowitzki. And uh, he could hit so hard. I don't know what ever happened to him. But... I put him aside. I like him. He's my favorite. One of my favorite players, Bobby Thigpen. Meet that guy. Sorry, I'm a Pirates fan. Kevin Sisler, nice. Rob Ritchie, Vince Coleman, nice. It's a little gold stamp card. A little Vince Coleman action. Vince Coleman. Randy McCants, Steve Colbert. Put that over. Oh, Fred McGriff, the Crime Dog. That's what they call him. Tony Panina, Hall of Famer, great, 1990s. Bob Welch, Hall of Famer. We got this one with three people. That has Miguel Cabrera, Xavier Borgatz, and Jose Atula. Those are three really good players. Yes. Good hit. This might be a variation card. No, it's not the high one. This dude, for some reason, he gets a lot of really different variations card. You at that, you at this, this, the rich. He's a good pitcher. You were Dirsch or whatever. And Manny Margaret. I don't see this is his major. No. It's a re remake of 1971 baseball. That's what that looked like back in the day. Like and then we have Eric. Oh my goodness. This is nerve wracking. These cards are upside down like this. Okay. The chain. This is a cool one, Sean. That is a cool one. Yeah, that's a Bowman, dude. Chrome. I put that in paint sleeve. Okay, we got this one. Here's this is a cool one. Because uh, Mile High Memories. And we got Matt Holiday, God bless his soul. And Troy Tullowiski. And they were two great like pitchers. Both of them. Troy fell off the train, though. And Mr. Holiday passed away. God bless him. Player. This one's pretty cool. That is cool. I don't know. Who's that? No clue. Oh, Rafael Pereira. Yeah, he like I said, he got caught the steroids. So the I don't know about him going anywhere. They won't even let. They're 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 giving him what's his face a hard time. Uh, Kurt Kurt Schilling because of his political beliefs, he's one of the best pitchers. He told he told him he actually told him to take him out of, off the list of being the Hall of Fame. Oh man, oh oh, we got a biggie. Tops future star, Yasuma Gardella. He is a huge player right now for Dodgers. It's 2016. We did some trades with this guy. He's a good player. And then we got my man, Tory Hunter, MVP. Tory Hunter's good. Oh my God! Look at this race chrome. Please say it's not messed up. Yes, it is. Mikel McCorrick. Mikel McCorrick from minor league. What year is this? 2007. And then we got Prince Fielder before he got big enough to where they had to put him on first base. He was huge. Huge. Anyway, I actually met him a few times. He dated my mom's friend, one of my mom's friends. She was friends with him and for a long time. He's a very nice guy. Very, very nice person. Big man. Huge. He moved, like, you know, I've only seen a couple of guys in my life as big as him. And, um... One was Shaq. I met Shaq uh, when I went to Atlantic. I mean, I wasn't sitting there hanging out, drinking beers or anything. When I'm, I was <laughs> standing next to him and got autographed. And I'm 5'8", and he was like, uh, I shrunk a little bit as I got older. But <clears throat> he uh, he is a big, big man. Holy smokes. Oh, I have this pack now. You want to crack them open? See what you got? You. Yeah. All right. Let's put these in pants here. Right. We're gonna crack this open now, folks. See what we get. Okay, we're looking for. Uh, I think we're looking for either boat. You got some Bo Jacksons in there, probably, and you also have uh, Ken Griffey Jr. Obviously, we're looking for him. Cal Ripken, Nolan Ryan, uh, any Hall of Famers like that, and we're also looking for uh, 
uh, Mike Smith, I mean Mike uh, Piazza rookie card. So these are got the least set here. I'm gonna pull off. I don't even know what the hell's in here. There might be an autograph they say or whatever. Okay, that's what they look like. We all know what they look like. <coughs> well, most of us. Uh, they've been opening these boxes, and this is our time area area, and there are Hall of Famers in here, like I say, but I usually there's an Eddie Murray Murray this good. His name is that that's our insert special insert, and this dude was one of the best pitchers. Walt Very West. Sticky cards. Yeah, Joe Carter, Hall of Hall of Famer. We got three Hall of Famers so far. I mean, for sure. Peter Hoy. Dale Murphy. Nice, nice, nice. Dale Murphy. Look at this. That's pretty nice. Ken Hill. Room and the goose. All right. So that's not bad. That is not bad. What do you got over there, buddy? Let's see um, what you have. Do you want to look through them? <coughs> sure. Okay. Andy Lawson. Lenny Dystra. Kurt, Kurt Schilling. Good one, man. Kenny McDonough. He was, he was good. I think this fellow threw his arm out or something. Look how hard he throws the ball. Jesus. Hard to read that. Jack Clark. There's another Hall of Famer. Nice, nice, nice. John Foley. Maybe the cards are too. I'm sorry about doing it. This way it is. Hubie Brooks. Good card. End of his career. Hall of Famer. Let's just stuck together. Here, yeah, these are the ones. So when they're stuck together, it's, oh man, Johnny, there's a good one. The surface didn't get messed up. Here's the card that was on top of it. There's your card, this regular one, and that's a nice insert. It's pretty cool. Very cool. He's a good player too. Wally Joyner, another possible Hall of Famer. I didn't even see this one. Yeah, it's stuck together. We got two of them here. Oh man, you got two good cards stuff. You got I've got another black one, dude. You did good in this pack. I didn't know that. Wally Joyner, Hall of Famer. Possible. Dave Wiss, he's a hell of a pitcher for Toronto. That is a beautiful card. These cards are in nice condition. They'd probably be 8.5s, 9s, maybe. But don't care because of the age of them. Stan Belinda, Pirate. Omar Vasco Alvarez. This dude's the beast. And then you got Brian Jordan. He's a good player too. So, out of all the cards, what's the, what's the ones you, that gave you that were special? What's Jesus the other black card? One. You got them both together? So you did pretty good. Pretty good. Not bad at all. We got some... I think for five bucks, what the hell? You know what I mean? And if you decide to put the set together, you definitely have a variety of choices here. And they're not gonna be all gem mint or whatever, but at least you can put them in a binder. And uh, definitely made five bucks back at uh, least. Oh yeah. I mean, you can just sell each card for one buck. Yeah. So then it's worth the. Well, five bucks. and not only that, see, you're getting stuff like this, which is very difficult. And he got a flare card, which they're really hard to find and in any condition. But look at all these Hall of Famers and rookies. This car, these cards, I have a few of these. I have a Bo Jackson, a couple of Bo Jacksons like this. And I have uh, a couple of Hall of Famers. But this right here is his, uh, his Tom Seaver at the age of 31 in 1976. Games played. And it's showing his stats compared to that. And this is two, 1999. Dave, David Cohn was one of the reasons why, I know a couple other pitchers, why they won the World Series against the Braves. The one time, because the pitching the Braves had was phenomenal. But Jeter's the best uh, in the playoffs. So, anyway, tell us what you think. What do you think, Joshua? You did pretty good, man, right? I like them. Yeah, we got five bucks. We got a football one to do, too. So, um, please like and subscribe to our channel. And then you got Monster Cards, right? Yes. So, you can please subscribe to that, too. Look them up. We're going to put some uh, videos on there for them and do some stuff like that. So, you yeah, five bucks, ninety-two. I actually got another pack here. I haven't even opened up. 
What the hell? Let's do this in here. What you give that? The other pack that I got for four. I just, I'm worried because those cards are sticking so bad right now. The ones that you just pulled out, I don't know what that happened to these ones. These actually got some decent stuff in them. And from the way that they're doing business, oh, I hate that sound. That does not sound good. We got David Cohn. He's batting. Sticking. Yeah, it's sticking. We got stickers. Why is this? Because they're packed for so long. Dude, this is th over 30 years old. Okay, on the front of the card, there's mad damage. Mad damage. There's like just mad damage on it. And it's a shame because he's actually batting. He's a pitcher. And uh, this stuff here, I knew this was going to do this. Yeah. Hmm. Of course. Jesus Christ. Stick again? Seen. No, dude. It's Deion Sanders. Rookie card, Deion Sanders. Jesus. Anyway. Ooh. Yeah, I know. Over. Deion Sanders. 125 <laughs> games played. I have the original rookie card, but that's pretty badass. That's a good hit. I consider that hit any Deion Sanders stuff. In my opinion, is a hit. And worthy of a pain sleeve. And this stuff right here, you got Greg Olson. I have his autograph. He's a good dude. 1999 club membership. You could order online and, or whatever back in the day. And then Tom Pagagaguza. Tom Pagagaguza. But the bag of, <laughs> Jesus, I can't speak tonight. These people need to get normal names. Um, Ken Hill. And then we got Ivan Kedrin. He was a huge, huge hitter. He's a good player. Good player. George Bratt. Nice. Two Hall of Famers, man. George Bratt. End of his career. Definitely be a penalty on that. I don't know what to think of this. <laughs> you gotta be very delicate delicate. Tim Jones. Stuck together. Andy. Is there my trout in there? No. no. Just, my trout was just being born. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. He's only like twenty five. Oh! What's this? Tom Cadidati. Good, the last card's good. No, it's trash. Scott Erickson. Oh. They're all trashed up, but still, you got a couple Hall of Famers in here. Mm -hmm. I mean, definitely. <laughs> I got I did open it because it just was getting stickier and stickier, and you can ruin the cards. And we got a Deion Sanders, and that's what's up. Deion Sanders and my man. Here, this dude hits balls that probably still haven't landed yet. Look him up. Ivan Caldero. Caldero. He was a badass hitter. Kip Gross was another guy that was supposed to be good. I think he got injured. There's a lot of good guys, especially on some of these guys. on they got YouTube channels, and, and there's one guy. Um, I forget his name. He played for Colorado Rockies, I believe, in and he makes baseball bats, and people use his baseball bats. He's very talented at making bats. The Major League Baseball people use his bats. So, that's kind of cool. Let us know what you think. Please like and subscribe. And, uh, let us know what you think of these awesome treats. Yeah. What, what do you think? I like it for five bucks. All right. We out. Bye. Bye.